Welcome back to the Blackcast Reacts. I'm Matt. And I'm Jeff. And today we are doing the Devil's Wears Parada Swalt. Salt. Yes. Salt. Salt. Um, so remember, Devil Wears Parada, they changed their sound a lot. Yes. So I was, it took me a few years to listen to their their last album, The Act. That came out, I think it was like, 2018, 2019, something like that. Okay, I don't think I actually ever listened to that. So yeah, okay. it took me a while to listen to it, and I, I was actually like pleasantly surprised. Okay. It was pretty good. It was obviously different than like way different than yeah. you know their roots or whatever. Um, but I, I I did end up liking it. So I'm assuming that this is going to be something similar to that. I don't know why okay. I would assume that because we we did the zombie two. We EP. did the zombie two EP. I think that was like that was our first episode, well, along with Darko. Remember you asked me like, what would I prefer this one or Darko? I was like, zombie two. And you're like, why? Oh yeah. 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 So I'm assuming that it would be similar to that act album. That's a very different sound. So that's just my assumption, but, um, I haven't heard anything new by them uh, since since the zombie two EP. So yeah. Rock and roll. Yeah. Let's do it. Already very different. (laughs) (laughs) Okay. Different than the act. Act was kind of like slower ish, you know. hesitant oh it gets so far I'm embracing their change why does that rhythm seem familiar the way he's singing it I wasn't expecting the vocals just to completely drop out. Yeah. It's almost like the chorus is more instrument. Interesting. No singing during the chorus. Yeah. The screamer had a guest vocal spot on the uh, silver screen. Track six or seven. Okay. Mike. I think it's that's his name, Mike Ferranda. Or maybe this is the chorus. I think I was mistaken. Yeah. Here. I don't know why, but it didn't feel like a chorus to me, but. <clears throat> It's just yeah, it's not like it's a favorite band that you are disappointed in the way they change. No, but like they had such a unique sound, and now they they sound like everybody else now. And I think that's my biggest problem. And I know we talked about this on one of the other ones. Like they like it's not that I don't want them to succeed. It's just they had such an interesting sound. <laughs> And they kind of buried it with this like palisade type sound. Although that was cool. <laughs> I, I did like that. I like when people throw their guitars around. Like they don't cost a couple hundred dollars. <laughs> For a thousand. <laughs> yeah. If they're uh, the ones I buy are a couple hundred. Yeah. Those are I liked I liked it. 
I like it a lot. If it wasn't the Devil Wears Prada, I think I would have liked it. Does that? I don't know if that makes any sense. No, it does. It's it's it just because like because they had their they had their unique sound, and even <laughs> when they like changed it with like some of like the zombie stuff and whatnot, it was their sound. You could tell like that's Devil Wears Prada, and like they were on the radio with like Zombie One. Which radio station? Uh, 89X, before it went country. Okay. Yeah. So they like they were on the radio with their screaming and like their own sound and whatnot. And now they just sound like Palisades to me. And I like Palisades, but that's Palisades. You know? And I, that, like, that's, I think that's my biggest problem with with bands changing their sound. And I, like I'm not trying to gatekeep because people are allowed to like things. It's just for me, it just... Like, I'm not going to judge you for liking it, but it's just mm-hmm. like it. Well, yeah, they weren't one of my favorites, but when I wanted to listen to Devil's Prada, like I wanted to listen to, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I get where you're coming from, where it does it it does tend to have that familiar sound that a lot of bands are like transitioning to mm-hmm. nowadays. But from like a business standpoint, and I want to make money standpoint. I get it. I get it. I, I, I am, I am the, the older, not that I'm old, but the older that I get, I, I completely understand it because if, if they continue to make, we, we, we both know that bands like this, like, let's say, um, you know, even zombie two or like with roots above mm-hmm. branches below. Yeah. Those you're not making money as a band. You're just not. Yeah. You have to pay your record label back. You have to do this. You have to do that. You have to, you're, you're, it's like you're living paycheck to paycheck as a band. So if they want to transition into something like this, the more that I am discovering bands doing that, I'm, I'm okay. I'm totally okay with it. And I never thought I'd be the person to say that. Cause I, cause like when bands change their sound, I used to be the first one to be like, all right, like, why are you doing that? Let me know if you need anything. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh. But, Apparently, uh, <clears throat> you activated my phone with that. <laughs> You've activated my trap card. <laughs> <clears throat> um, I, I, like, like we were talking about earlier with uh, Indie Ghost, I see both sides. I totally I, see like, I sides. understand it. But I guess that business decision... For me, I'm just not gonna buy into. Mm-hmm. Like I'll, I don't know. Like I see where you're coming from, but then at the same time, like there's a lot of heavy metal bands out there that don't that like make money. Get and they also have other jobs. Yeah. Well, you get your foot in the door with other other things like you start getting your own line of whatever and whatnot i don't know it's no i like i get it i get it this is where the money's just talk with my hands now i'm just (laughs) bull in the china shop i i get it this this is the style of music that where the money's at it just isn't for me okay yeah like I said, I would like it if it wasn't the Devil Wears Prada. Like, I, I don't know how else to say that. Yeah, I mean, it's like, I always I always think about in my head, I'm like, I like Fall Out Boy, and I like, let's say, like, some rap. But if, like, Fall Out Boy made a rap album, I wouldn't like it. Even if the songs were good. It's like, that's, I, that's not what I want to listen to when it's Fall Out Boy. Yeah, and yeah. I guess it's, like, the same thing. Like, I want to listen, if I want to listen to, to Devil's Were Prada, I want to listen to the Devil's Were Prada. I don't want to listen to Palisades. Yeah. I feel you. Yeah. But, all right. Anything else? No, I'm good. I, I, I feel like I just, like, tore into this one again, but. It's a reaction video if you don't like it. You don't like it. It's all good. All right. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you guys in the next video. See you later.